All right, much better. This is the second intro I'm doing. I had to restart because the audio sounded so bad on the other phone. We're gonna switch over to vlog style for a little bit. Uh, now that everybody's growing up, you know, Tristan's got a baby. All my other friends have full-time jobs. I do too. So not everybody has time to record, I get it. But we're gonna switch over to vlog style. That way I can actually keep doing videos. Sorry for the messy shop. It is kind of ridiculous in here. We got a couple projects going. Yes, yeah, so we're gonna switch over to the vlog style. Tell me if you like it, tell me if you don't. Because obviously when we do dumb stuff, whether it be messing with the Subaru, beating the dog piss out of this thing, obviously we're gonna have some other people record too from time to time, but for now, we just don't have the, uh, I just don't have the resources, unfortunately, you know? Vlog, blog, I don't know the difference between the two, but uh, this is what it's gonna be from now on. 700 subscribers, that's crazy. That's a lot of people, if you think about it. That is a lot of people. I, you couldn't fill this shop with 700 people. That means 700 of you guys were like, you know what, this guy's cool enough, we'll give him a chance. We'll, we'll subscribe, we like him so much. Thanks, guys. 708 subscribers right now. Thank you, that's crazy. We're gonna be doing exhaust on the Shelby. Right now it's got MagnaFlows. Uh, I bought a set of courses for 100 bucks, and then I also got my old Flowmasters. We're gonna see what sounds best. I'm gonna put them all on there, you know, the courses and the Flowmasters tomorrow. Uh, the courses have different flanges. They're not slip-on flanges like these ones are. So we're gonna have to hit the muffler shop tomorrow. We were gonna do it tonight, but he texted me back saying he doesn't wanna do it until tomorrow, so I was like, okay, you know, that's fine. But anyways, here's a little bit of rundown on the, the uh, GT500. It's 2009. It has, when I got it, it was bone stock. But a JLT cold air intake and a smaller pulley. Now it's cammed, long tubes, Catless X pipe, MagnaFlows. It was on lowering springs. Ugh, get that out of here. All right, you already know we had to go to bags because we're all about that stance life. It's on three-piece Weds, Kranz, Vishnu's or Vishunu's. I don't know. There's, Every post I look at, one of them says Vishnu, one of them says Vishnu. It's one of the two. That's just a daily. It's gonna stay that way. You know, I don't know, I might, be a, I might buy a four liter Whipple for it. I don't know, we, we might fuck around and find out in the future. The daily, that's the race car, that's the race car, and that's my buddy's car. Get that thing out of here, Mason. I'll see you guys tomorrow. All right, it's like seven in the morning. I figured, uh, obviously, we gotta get a cold start video. We got a couple things to take care of first. I gotta move some stuff out of the way and air this tire up real fast. And then we'll, we'll do a little cold start. I put my heart on my lips. I gave it all I could give. I made it hot at the crib. I kept it fire at the crib. Where you gonna go when you do? How I'm a no. Don't, just, just ignore that. Absolute unit. 
all right, I guess I'm going to go to work for the rest of the day and then, um, yeah, we'll figure it out from there. So, uh, it turns out on bags even aired all the way up. I don't know if you can see that. We get stuck in the car wash. Try to back out. Yeah. Yeah, we're good. Oh, shit. Give me a push, boys. We got stuck. Well, I appreciate it, guys. You're gonna back me out, I guess. <laughs> it's oh, yeah. all good. Let me get you your money. Yeah. And yeah, I'll talk to you. Yeah, thanks. Yeah, so we got stuck. That was kind of sick. It's too low, man. Too low, man. It is what it is, right? It looks good, though. Thanks, bro. Hey, you never know what's gonna happen. I didn't think that was going to happen to me today. Got stuck inside a car wash. Damn. And I'm aired all the way up. I mean, my back, my rear bags are at 114 PSI right now. It's ridiculous. I'll, I'll get out and show you guys a... I'll show you guys what it looks like. It probably looks stupid right now. But hey, you know what? You can't win them all, you know? Here, let me get out and put this camera around. <laughs> uh, just too low. Just too low even aired up like that. That's insane. Too low, eh? Yes, sir. <laughs> Fuck, it is what it is, I guess. Yeah. Alright, we are back to normal. Homeboy just hooked me up, gave me some cash since uh, I couldn't go through the car wash. And he, uh, he actually recommended me go to a, uh, a self car wash. I was like, yeah, well, didn't think of that. I honestly didn't think it would get stuck, aired all the way up. That wasn't the... Uh, the problem wasn't that we were too low. The problem was that my lower control arms, because I have lower control arm relocation brackets, you know, it drops them down so I don't wheel hop as bad, or at all for that matter. But uh, they were getting caught on the rails. So I couldn't, I just couldn't go through. I got stuck, they had to push me out. Damn, that was, makes for good content. Hey, makes for good content, right? That's something. So we're gonna go spray this thing off because it's got like half a spray on it and uh, we'll make her nice and clean. All right, guys. So <laughs> that was pretty funny. The guys there were pretty cool. They all liked the car. You know, they thought it was awesome. As soon as I pulled up, they're like, oh, dude, that's so cool, whatever. This thing's so clean, which is awesome. I love getting compliments like that. <laughs> Didn't expect to get stuck. Definitely added some spice to my day, I guess you could say. That was fun. Um, but now we're at this other car wash, so we are going to wash the car. This dirty SO. Look at these wheels. Oh my God, they're so neglected. That's disgusting. I don't know why I let it get like this, honestly. I, something's wrong with me. But it's a good thing it gave me cash, though. <laughs> I paid with a car. They gave me cash, which is awesome because I didn't have cash on me. I'm going to throw some cash in that thing. So uh, I'll wash this thing and I'll get back to you guys. I pull a four and a fill. You already know what it is. I keep a pole in the wheel. Cut a lot of these niggas out here in me. It ain't no horn and clear. None of my dogs, I fuck with Tennessee. I don't need so no sympathy. Sippin' on Hennessy, got me being sideways. Everything on me drippin', you niggas came. So, the car's clean now. Now we're about to head to, uh. Ew, yuck. Amber? Gross. We're about to head to, uh. Rod's muffler, get some exhaust on this thing, and I will see you guys when I get there, I guess. No, there's some things that just don't sound better. Like that. All right, guys, we just pulled up to Rod's. This is so much more cringe when there's people watching me do it. All right, guys, we just pulled up to Rod's. I'm a little late. So I figured, you know, it's kind of cold outside, right? I don't want to get out and wash my car. So I did what any logical person would do, right? And I took it to a drive-in car wash. I got stuck in the drive-in car wash. They had to push me out, dude. <laughs> I got stuck on them. Yeah, they were like, dude, your car's so sweet, blah, blah, all this stuff. They were really cool guys. They were like, the car's awesome. Pull the car wash, just goes, Erk! and I was like, the fuck? Ram! I'm like, okay, weird. Reverse, Ram! I'm like, dude, what the fuck? And they're like, they're like, 
what's going on? I'm like, I'm stuck. I don't know. You tell me, dude. You're out there. I'm in the car. So that's why I'm late. These are uh, these are fake cats. They're just flow through mufflers, basically. But you know, they look like cats. So uh, I can still pass safety on inspection. But yeah, you see, long tubes, looking a little rough. X pipe. The muffler's going on. Look at this. This this is insane to me. See this oil pan? Look at that. Not a dent in it. Three valve? Been smacked so many times when it was on coilovers. I'm glad I just threw the bag straight on this thing. It's still dirty though. I mean the wheels and everything. Like, here, come take a look at this wheel. I need to actually like polish them and clean them up, but Alright guys, we've decided on this one. This, this little tip right here. I don't know, it's not that big. What do you think? Got a tip oh, we got a 12 inch? Yes. <laughs> this little, what is this, a five? Seven. Seven, whatever it is. Five, seven, they're about the same. Ask your girlfriend. <laughs> All right, this is Flowmaster test take one. Listen to that girl purr. I like that. I like that. Orla sound test. Take one. So quiet at an idol. All right, we just got the exhaust done. I don't think it looks too bad. Some like four inch tips on the back there with the uh, the borlas. So now we're gonna do a little flyby. guys i just got home i gotta say the car sounds wicked it sounds great thanks caleb i appreciate that it sounds awesome if you want to start a youtube or a tiktok or whatever you want to do just do it people don't care that much honestly if there's people talking bad about you they're doing it behind your back nobody's said one bad thing to me but i've had a lot of people that come up to me that i haven't talked to in who knows how long they'll be like dude your videos are awesome i love watching them you make me laugh, whatever. That's awesome. So you're going to get a lot more love than you will hate, actually. And you can say what you want about me behind my back. I don't care. All right, it's cringe until it works. So just do your own thing. And at that, I think we will uh, end the video there. Thanks for watching. Uh, don't forget to like, comment, subscribe. And uh, have a good one.